Meanwhile, the latest data from the South African Chamber of Commerce and Industry reveals that business confidence in South Africa has reached its lowest point in 10 months. The Chamber Sentiment Index slipped to 107.8 in May, down from 108.9 in April and 114.7 in March. The average reading for the first five months of the year stands at 111.7. In light of this decline, the Chamber urges politicians to prioritise the economy as they negotiate the formation of a new government. The centrist Democratic Alliance has expressed interest in joining the new government, while the ANC has hinted at reaching out to all parties. CEO of the South African Chamber of Commerce and Industry, Alan Mukoki, shares his insights on this new development. Our view on the recently released Business Confidence Index obviously shows that the numbers are down month on month and as for the period ending April. We think that this is occasioned largely by the fact that South Africa was going to have provincial and national elections and as a result of pollsters uh, in the main had indicated that the ANC as a ruling party over many years would actually lose uh, its majority in the National Assembly. That in itself would come with a level of nervousness and anxiety because people don't know what then it would mean for policy certainty. As you know, people invest and they trade and they operate their businesses and they decide whether they are going to invest in new plant or acquire new businesses on the back of policy certainty in the economic environment. And that policy certainty comes largely as a result of negotiations and arrangements and discussions that tend to take place in places like NADLAC, where big business, big government, and big labor are actually represented. So a change in the political establishment may well entail uncertainty because you do not know who the new people are going to be and who the coalition partners are going to be. And given the, the volatility of the environment in South Africa, given the many different manifestos that we've seen, some being seen as more business friendly than the others, obviously that would impact uh, people's confidence in, in, in the South African economy. I think that we generally refer to this particular environment as the four horsemen of VUCA that have entered the environment, and VUCA stands for VUCA, which is volatility, uncertainty, complexity, and ambiguity of the environment that you now need to manage additional to trying to run your business and trying to drive the investment around suppliers, customers, uh, capital returns, and all those particular bits and pieces. And obviously, the situation is expected to remain the same for a period until the uncertainty of what's going to happen in the National Assembly, whether the parties that emerge agree on what policy options for South Africa in terms of growing the economy, uh, dealing with the issues of unemployment, of inequality, etc., etc. So I think that